Episode of So Duh. Duh. I'm Nando and Chuck. Chuck, what are we trying today? Today we are trying a Pepsi from Japan. It's a salt and lychee. 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 Uh, I'm excited for this because we just mentioned in the last episode uh, I tried salty watermelon Pepsi from Japan years ago with Chris. It's one of the best sodas I've ever had in my life. Uh, just delicious. So I hope this one lives up to it too. Uh, lychee, what do you guys think about it? The rain. Oh my energy. god, it fantastic! Is, it's. I think it might be my favorite energy drink of all time now. Cause like I, uh, for me it's up. Like I really like the uh, orange dreamsicle rain. It got better, but like I just like, don't like that. But it's like it's like right there for me. That like the orange dreamsicle is still my favorite. Yeah, I, the rain. Though, it's so weird. Like I was, you know, I was on the bang the bang train as A3K says. It took too long. And then like uh, once rain came out, I cannot drink bang anymore. Bang is a hundred percent. Yeah, it's like, too harsh. Ready. Uh, it's got all that creatine and workout shit in it too, and rain rain does. It almost it. has the monster harshness to it. Uh, I think the two best rain flavors though are the lychee flavor and then the uh, red dragon. I never had red dragon. The red dragon is like uh, it's like an otter pop. It's absolutely delicious. Interesting. Have you ever had rain? Yeah. Which one do you like? Uh, what's that blue one? Oh, that's the uh, that's the blue like blue version of the red dragon. It's yeah. it's in the gray can. It's yeah. the blue blazer. The one that's the worst though, hey, there's two that are tied. The lemon one is gross, and the uh, the jalapeno strawberry. Do they even make disgusting? <laughs> Do they even make lemon heads one anymore, or the war the lemon one, one they still make? Oh, the warheads one, yes, they still have it. I still see it. The sour, the sour heads or whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't like any of those though. Okay. You know what ruined all of them for me though? The no, no, the fucking four loco, the four loco sour apple. I can't anymore after doing that. I get so many people that message me and go. Do the one four loco a day for every day for a month. And I'm like, I can't. I'll get PTSD. Like, I can't do that Speaking shit. Speaking of four loco, four loco, where's the pregame at? Yeah, what the fuck? The pregame we can't find, and like they haven't oh, released yeah, any other flavors. Like, what's going on? They've stalled out. The, my, my... I see everybody finding the pregame, but I can't I know, find the pregame. And it's not on their website if you can't locate yeah, it. Could they still show camo? I'm like, camo's not even a thing no. for you guys anymore. My, uh, my contact said that they're supposed to be coming out with like three new flavors and one return. But he wouldn't. He said, "I can't tell you what the return is." Oh. But if if I had to pick one that I want back the most from the original oh, run, hurricane. oh, I want the uh, the raspberry lemonade. That Ooh. was that's the one that we first one we reviewed yeah. in Vegas. Remember that? Yeah, yeah. I want that one back. But yeah, it'd be interesting. All right, ready? Let's do it. That is odd. <laughs> yeah, that's weird. It smells weird. Like as I was getting the swig, I was like, "Whoa." <laughs> It's definitely lychee, but like that salt like the is... Ooh. aftertaste, like it gets better, but that first initial taste, it's like, what the hell's going on? It's like carbonated, but not carbonated? It's yeah. so strange. What in the hell is going on with that? Huh. This isn't lychee. It's lychee. It's lychee. lychee. Wait, is lychee lychee though? No. It... Lychee is L-Y-C-H-E-E. -E. But it does taste like, like it though. It tastes the same. Like the same idea, because it tastes a lot like the rain flavor. It has that similar thing. It's just nowhere near as good. Yeah, I don't know what this is. I have no idea either. It's not too good. It's like, mm. a, like a high two, maybe. Yeah, I think I'd rather yeah. have regular Pepsi. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Our shitty yeah, version. Regular Pepsi's a five out of five seal approval for me. This uh, one's a two. I don't think I would go that high. With Pepsi. I would. Yeah, I'm, I'm I would, a Pepsi. No. I'm a Pepsi guy. I don't like colas. Colas in general, like give me, give me more like fruity stuff over colas. Uh, okay, well, I mean, I'm just gonna give it a like a high two. It's not very good. Uh, nothing really about it is all that good. It's kind of a disappointment. The, the bottle looks nice. Yeah, it's pretty unique, but... <laughs> I watched a thing where they talked about Dumb and Dumber, when he does the, you want to hear the most annoying oh, yeah, sound yeah. That was completely ad-libbed. He did really? he, that was not in the script. He just <laughs> they just told them like they had a couple of lines and they just told Jim Carrey and uh, and uh, Jeff Daniels. They were like just piss him off. Like just do it do whatever you can to make him upset and he'll react. Same to thing it. with the uh, the the 7-Eleven scene. Oh, oh big old bug. They said like those two guys weren't even extras. They're just two people that happened to be hanging out outside during the filming. Big so they like, say big gulp, huh? <laughs> <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> I've never seen the sequel. I heard it was awful. Oh, it's Dumb and Dumber, like Dumb and Dumber. -er, no, wasn't it? no, Dumb and Dumber -er was the second one. That was the prequel. The yeah, yeah. Okay. Third I one. I never saw that one either. The third one is god awful. Dumb and Dumber two. Yeah. The premise though is so good. Like when I saw the scene. No, I saw the scene where like he's been catatonic since the first movie, oh, yeah, yeah. and he's. 
Oh my gosh! <laughs> like you've been pretending this whole time. Yeah, brilliant. Like that's great. But then apparently the movie's just garbage. Yeah, like that's like probably the best joke of the entire movie. Yeah, he's well, uh, Jim Carrey is so interesting because like he's sometimes he makes good movies nowadays, but rarely. Like uh, when he was in Kick Ass Two, he was the best part of Kick Ass Two. But then he dies like what ten minutes, fifteen minutes in, and then like then the movie just is just garbage. Like Kick Ass One is perfect. Kick Ass Two is awful like it's almost unwatchable poor jim carrey uh I, he also has like heavy ptsd from like getting his girlfriend killed too so that's not good yeah good <laughs> nope Oh, I missed one.